Every generation will not be confused. There is a generation that will get this thing. Say the compressed coffee from that day. The creative dimension of the prophetic. There must be a performance because. One of the chiefest reasons why the saints may not experience the fullness of the life, the power, and the glory of God. Hallelujah. Second Corinthians chapter 4 and verse 4. That this Satan has now become what? Look up please. Who suddenly coronated him to become the God of this world. The last time we read, he is a victim who was thrown out from heaven. Now Satan was not just roaming around the earth he had manipulated the system and risen in ranking to now become the god of this world he was not thrown as the god of this world he was thrown as one who was exposed to the vengeance and the judgment of god but satan to show you the extent of his the flawlessness of his craftsmanship through the ages manipulated systems and men until he rose to this rank and earned himself an office as the god of this world follow me carefully are we together are you following my story so it starts with a tragic event in revelation that a seeming weak being was thrown to the earth and god warned us he said be careful with this guy don't take him for granted this satan is not foolish he is a master at deception and he's a master at accusation F, pay attention to this being if you ignore him it will be to your peril and here is the effect of neglecting his warning satan suddenly has found his way through the ages and crowned himself a name that even the bible honors the god of this world he couldn't be the god in heaven but he found himself a space. Is, is, are we following together? <laughs> you reign, you ancient Zion's king, Kadosh, Kadosh. You are mighty on your throne. You reign, you ancient Zion's king, is showing us the continuity of the ministry of this strange serpent who is called satan he's also called the devil how he rose to this rank is a mystery that we all know we we'll have to go to the book of genesis to see the the showmanship of his artistry that this man is anything but foolish are we together now there was a reason why heaven was crying and saying, Earth, on your own you are already in trouble. That this man deceived one third of the angels in heaven. Oh, Earth, there is trouble. There is trouble and we will not hide it. That Satan. And now we see that Satan had earned himself a title. Now, let me tell you, whoever starts as a weak man in life, and becomes a lord of anything should be respected who assisted him is a mystery how the other demons did not fight him and remain loyal even in his rebellion is a mystery we must learn when the bible says be wise as serpent it's a technology that we must employ for our dominion in today's world what did satan use that even in the face of failure the angels did not run away look at this in whom the God of this world. Paul is a dangerous man. That guy 
is a dangerous man. How Paul saw this. The Bible says, now the God of this world, and then it now gives us a picture of one of the ways that he has sustained his ascendance. The Bible says there is something he does to the minds of a people and a territory that Satan is not concerned about your eyes. The God of this world operates by blinding the minds of them that believe not. Left, he's afraid of one thing. The Bible exposes the one act enemy of Satan. And the enemy is not angels. The enemy is not even men. The enemy is light. Now watch this please. Understand my teaching tonight. Here is a man who has been cast down on earth. And while he was on earth, the Bible tells us that he found a way of achieving this goal. From generation to generation, he is able to cast a spell upon the minds of people and find a way of inhibiting individuals, territories, families from seeing the glorious gospel of Christ who is the image of God that when that light is allowed to shine on them there is an effect it is impossible for that light to shine upon an individual to shine upon a people the Bible finally reveals that Satan can be afraid and it tells us what he's scared of not angels not heaven not prayer not man light are you following me tonight we're dealing with something very serious so satan does not fear technology satan does not fear education satan does not fear men satan does not even seem to have if he dead god who will he fear but there is a mystery that something light does to satan satan is threatened by light he goes out of his way he does not take chances from children to the elderly ones he sees you his first test is are you seeing the moment you are seeing you are a threat to satan that the, the power of satan is when you are blind blindness that when a man cannot see the Bible says that Satan will leave him and remain the God of this world. Are we together? So this is it. That there is one of the dominion systems of the kingdom that the Bible guarantees as revealed by Satan's own testimony that when Satan finds men, he doesn't tie their hands, he doesn't tie their finances, he doesn't tie anything. He goes straight to their minds, the center of illumination and knowledge, and that he can cast a spell once that happens. How many of you have seen people remove something from a scorpion? There's something they say, a scorpion is weak, but once you remove that sting, you can allow it to go around. This is it. Let me show you a scripture. I pray that God will open our eyes to see something powerful tonight. Matthew chapter 13 starts from verse 10 to 17. Jesus, your Jesus, my Jesus, mentor Jesus. When Jesus is teaching, listen to him. He's communicating an intelligence. Remember, he called himself the light of the world. That means already that name is a threat I, I i hope we already identified what scares satan that the moment there is the mention of light satan is on peace now jesus did not bring light he now came and said i am so when the light is speaking it means anything he tells you is a weapon of victory light me lord light me lord light me lord light the candle light me lord Light me, Lord, light me, Lord, light the candle, light me, Lord, light 
give us that Thank you for watching our entire video today. If you feel you can bless someone, please join us and spread the gospel by sharing this video on your social media.